Hey folks, Carl Kuster here, probably getting some miles on the new G4 Summits. Um, we're getting some big snow, so hopefully you're getting lots of miles. One thing I wanted to talk to you about was uh, chain tension. So a cool little trick, makes it fast and easy. If you elevate the back of the sled, put the parking brake on, you can grab your secondary clutch. You can leave the belt on it. Just rock it back and forth. And you can see you got a fair bit of chain play. And with the brake locked, it holds the ad drive axle. So then it's just taking up the play on the chain. So if we go around the other side, I'll show you where to turn it. So one trick that we do when you're checking chain tensions, this kind of comes from the race world, we mark everything. So I mark the, mark the, uh, bolt and the case so now i can tell how many turns i'm turning and we checked on there and we could see there was a fair bit of play and they don't ever need much more than finger tight so there's one turn there's a flat spot which is rides on the pin and that keeps the retainer in the right spot so we're about a turn and a half is about as tight as I can get it. So I'm going to back it off to the flat spot and you'll feel the detent where it's seated on the spring. And then I'll go back over and wiggle the secondary back and forth. And you can feel that's about as tight as it wants to be. If there's lots of play, it'll it'll rotate quite a bit so try to stop on that detent if possible a cool tip when you're checking the tension of the drive chain is with the park brake locked I'll stick my the allen wrench for adjusting the clickers and I'll just stick it through the little round hole right above the brake caliper and stick it in the clutch or stick it up against the clutch put a little mark there. The park brake is still on and I just move it back and forth and as long as that is about three to five millimeters or roughly three sixteenths of an inch of play with the parking brake on, that's plenty good. That's close enough. If you're bigger than that, I would say go over and have a, have a little peek at the chain tensioner and you're set to go. Have fun.